All right, broski, so a couple days ago, I painted this uh, G37 hood. In today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how to um, sand it down, water sand it, and buff it um, after you paint a part. So I'm not that good at this. It's This is kind of like my first time actually doing it. And uh, hopefully I don't mess it up. But if I do mess it up, then I'll just repaint it. So what I did here is I put a tape right in the middle. Um, we're only gonna do half. So we can tell the difference you know so we're only going to do the left side and then uh once we're done we'll compare both sides and see if it made a difference or if we if it comes out better or if i fuck it up so let's get it boys all right broski so for this project we're going to be using this machine we have a uh, some wool right here this one's a little used so i don't know if i'm going to be using this one but i have some uh polishing bonnets bonnets so we got that shit we got we got a new one already on and then for this uh, sanding process we're gonna be using a thousand grit first and then going over with a 2000 after that and then finishing it off with a 2000 grit so all right broski so i'm gonna be really gentle when sanding it down because uh you don't want to scratch this uh you don't want to scratch the the clear too much so I'm just going over it really, really gentle, not too harsh, you know, just whatever the weight on, just putting the weight on my hand and then just sanding it down. So I heard black is really complicated. It's also like, like I noticed when I started painting it, I noticed that um, dirt goes on it like, like really fast, you know, so. It's best if you have a booth. It's best if you have a booth when painting uh, black cars. I mean, any other car, you know, but I think, I mean, with every car or part, it's always recommended to use a booth. Um, but like with lighter colors, like my red car, um, it still, it caught a little bit of dirt, but it wasn't like that much, you know, it's not that noticeable. Like on black cars, like on black, you can see a lot. It's probably hard to tell on the camera, but in person, I didn't really like it. That's why um, I'm on a buffer for the homie. But hopefully, like I said, hopefully I don't mess it up. And then gotta use a lot of water. we'll see hopefully it comes out pretty good hopefully we get that mirror finish that'll be sick if I can make this hood look good broskis I'm gonna repaint my car and then I'm gonna buff it and then it's gonna look like a show car if you guys think that thing look, looks like a show car right now you guys ain't ready but we'll see you know I'm, I'm trying to practice right here with this hood so don't judge me if you guys see that I'm doing something wrong let me know down in the comments I take advice as well like I said we're here to learn together by no means I'm no pro I'm not a pro you know but I'm not afraid to fuck shit up and redo it you know that's uh that's the good thing about me all right bros keys so um, let me turn out let me turn off the camera for a little bit and then um, so I can finish sending it down all right broskies I don't know I don't know how I'm feeling about this but check it out so I finished sending it down and then I started buffing it check it out this is what I have so far I've done like half of this shit but I don't know it kind of still looks cloudy I know um, after this compound I got to use like a uh, polishing like a wax type of um, liquid and then buff it with that but I don't know let me know what you guys think so far can't really tell but I still gotta give it more right here but I don't know we'll see I guess how it comes out I'll probably finish the whole thing tomorrow that way um, tomorrow we can see it like in the sun and shit but I don't know I don't know what you guys think. It still looks cloudy, like like a little bit of white. Well, check it out. 
I just gotta clean it off, but look, once I clean it off, it looks better. You can still see a little bit of the scratches, but hopefully with the uh, with the other uh, with like the polish liquid, um, we can take it off or it comes off. But I think it's coming out good. I'm gonna give it like another two two runs with the compound, and then we'll do the the other half. I think we got this. All right, first piece, it's the next day. I did half. Check it out. I still gotta do this side, but you can clearly see that it's not, it hasn't been buffed. And over here on this side, you can see the mirror reflection. Check it out. And check this side out. Can you see it or not? So, I think it's working, Bruskies. Yeah, you got some. And food. Sure, no. Two, three, no? Pretty good. Not bad. Como de dealer. Como de dealer. Como de agencia. Check out the difference, though. Oh, yeah. A lot, huh? With all the little rocks and stuff, they go away when you. Send it Did down. you do it with a block or just by hand? Nah, just by hand. Should I do it with a block? Like a, a thin one. I got one. I got this one, yeah. Let's <laughs> tira. This one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks good. That mirror finish. Yeah, you can tell the difference. Yeah, look at the sky, look at the clouds. And then look at the clouds over here. Yeah. And look at the clouds over here. Oh. King going. going. Show car quality. Yeah. That's like Chris quality. Chris quality. That shit looks good away from over here. <laughs> Alright, bro, someone I'm finish this up. And then you guys can see this video in the next next video. You're gonna see uh, Angel's car getting the motor done. Alright, broskies, I'm done with the hood. Check it out. Woo! Damn, son. Look at that. Look at that cloud right there. Damn. Came out pretty dope. A little bit of minor scratches that, can, that you can like barely see, but. Came out freaking fresh. I'm proud of myself. So the way I did it was, I did 1000 and then I went with the 1500. And then lastly I went with, oh no. A thousand, two thousand, no, a thousand, fifteen hundred, and then twenty five hundred. And then I use my compound with the uh, wool, and then after that, I did it with the uh, other polishing. These are the ones I use. I got these at the uh, detail garage, number V32. And then lastly, I went over it with a V36 cutting polish. They work pretty sick, so check it out. Came out. All right, broskies, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a, please drop a like, subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you guys next time. So.